previously on Welcome to the Family. Who is this guy he keeps spending some time with? His name is Victor Williams. This gun does not have a safety. I just need Victor there. I'm there. You can okay. count me. This is the last night of long hair. If I were a girl, I'd shave my head. Anyone can entertain you, but only we entertain you. With a mixture of fun, learning, and craziness, my team and I travel the world motivating and connecting with people. Are you ready? Welcome to the family. Valerie and I have been to a couple of events for the Miami Beach Chamber of Commerce and we found that this is really a chamber that we want to get involved with. And there's plenty of activities and things happening almost every single week with the chamber. We're planning a lot of different things with them and one of them is to coordinate a video for the annual meeting for their membership. So we are setting up and also waiting for Jerry's office and we can start filming. We're in a meeting right now, so we're not going to go in the room. However, I at least set up a camera before we get there. Behind the scenes film shoots. We've done this many, many a time before. Because we have a full-fledged film studio, what we do from time to time is for certain clients or just different business partners, we go on location and we basically bring the studio with us, which is pretty cool because we have a portable green screen we can set up, we have our cameras and lights, and basically we replicate what we have and what we're familiar with in studio on a remote location. If you want to get some footage, I'll come up with something to say to make me look brilliant. <laughs> now we're just going to test lighting. And I cannot believe that we are already set up in under 30 minutes. Say again. How does that work for you? That really works for me. Yes, I like when we set up fast. And whisper? And that is the cat. Yes. Alright, and then loud again? Sam, I am. <laughs> I was invited to do a radio spot for D-Works Live radio show. Give a very warm D-Works Live welcome to my special guest, none other than Mr. Bert Oliva. Well, thank you, D. Thank you so much for the opportunity of being able to be on your show. Yes, I'm so excited to have you here. And because what it is that we do, we decided to record a video version so that way you can see it. Tell our listeners, first of all, how did you even get into being such a positive person and such a motivating person? I was working for Xerox Corporation. They took you to these great venues that they had all these great speakers like uh, Jim Rohn, Zig Ziglar, Brian Tracy. And I remember looking at these guys in these huge auditorium and saying, one day I'm going to be doing just that. See, when you're doing a radio show, it's kind of difficult because people can't read your body language. So it's kind of hard to give your message every now and then when you have to really describe it. Can you talk about the journey and, and starting out from, I always say never frown at small beginnings. Everyone has had their story. Everyone has their testimonial. And mine basically came when I came to this country, the United States of America, I was 11 months old. And my mom decided to have uh, take a leap of faith by herself, came from Cuba. I never had a father, grandparents, brother or sister. My mom was my world about a year and a half ago she passed away. And my motivation came from watching her. I'd like you to introduce yourself and what you do. So many wonderful things happen here, Scene three, take two. Scene four, take one. Scene five, scene eight, take two. Scene 11, scene 12. Your resume of the future is not the work that you've done, but what's online. Make sure you know what you're putting up there because once it goes up there, it won't come down. Post something negative, it'll get thousands of hits and it'll get forwarded, it'll get yeah. shared. You post something positive, it's like crickets. Crick, 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 yep. crick, crick, crick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, it's difficult. And, and it's sad because that's what society has done. Yeah. You know, reality shows were great in the beginning. They were real. A lot of them are made up right now. Oh, yeah. Why? Because people want to see the arguments. They yeah. want to see the fights. Live life. Don't let life live you. Talk about how you came up with that and what does that mean? We spend too much time letting life guide us. Mm -hmm. You know, not being being in the driver's seat. You got to take control of your life. You got to make the right decisions. Life is about choices. Yeah. And while Dee was getting to know Bert, we were getting to know the faces of Miami Beach Chamber. But you're going to walk into the frame. Yes. Okay. Hi. <laughs> Just like give us some energy there. there it is. 
Hi, and welcome to the Miami Beach Chamber of Commerce. Today, you're going to get to see all of the exciting programs. Beautiful. Thank you very much. That's great. Wait. Although Bert is a local in South Florida, a lot of people still haven't had uh, the experience of watching him on stage. So we coordinated a keynote for Bert to speak at their annual meeting. Okay, Bert, um, how did you come up with The Potentialist and tell everybody what is The Potentialist? My tour group, the group that tours with me around the world, when you go to some of our shows, they actually participate in the show. So they'll teach you different things because I truly believe that a person that says that they can teach you everything is not someone you should be listening to. I have a group of experts that travel with me and they'll, depending on the, the speech that we're doing and so forth, they actually are part of the actual event. And I want to say thank you for being a guest on my show today, taking time out of your busy schedule because I know you're so busy out there making it happen. And I want to give a shout out to your team, to LJ, Val, Alexa. You have impacted quite a few people today. Thank you, Bert Oliva. Give Bert me one G. let's go, y'all, before you get off of here. Let's go, y'all. Don't forget to make it happen. All right. <laughs> so you'll be able to see the whole interview. All you have to do is click on the link below and you'll be able to watch it. However, if you move this link across and you feel like you want to invite us to one of your events or your shows or your interview, please feel free to contact me or one of the potentialists. When we went to the Miami Dolphins VIP event, we got sponsored tickets to go to an actual football game. And we went as an entire family. Where we going, man? Oh, damn. Oh, wow. no, I was gonna say. When we go to like sports games that we get invited to, I really don't know much about sports. I never been a sports fan. I am a family fan. Whatever it takes, whether it's a sports event or a concert, just being with the family is what makes it happen for me. I'm not the biggest fan of football, but because of the atmosphere and going with all the people that I love, it was a lot of fun. Miami And that day we had a great time at the stadium with the family. So even if that looked like a jam-packed day, we still have more to do because we actually got invited to a media night. We're on our way to Jungle Island. Which is a local amusement park down here in Miami, is actually having their first haunted house for the first ever Halloween. This is my first time in one of these scary things without birds. Oh really? It was scary. I may have screamed a bit. Terror in the jungle. I'm Bert Oliva from Bold Worlds. Welcome to the Family Show. And when I, hey, what? Yeah, it's kind of difficult when you talk to yourself. So what I want you to do is I want you to comment, subscribe, forward, repost, do whatever it is that you're gonna do to make sure no one misses this show. But do it now. Do do. What are you waiting for? Do it now.